What? Just one moment, please. Yeah, go, go ahead. Yeah. What's happened with my computer? The reason why we are contacting you is that for past few days, your computer is sending some error notification and warning messages to our technical server. So it's quite emergency. You have to block the hackers from your computer server. Your computer is illegally accessed by online hackers. Okay. Right, and where where are you calling from? We are based in Microsoft campus, same to Lit Park in Reading. You're calling from Reading in the UK, is it? Sorry? Where you're you're in Reading, did you say? Yes. Right. And how do you know that my computer is being hacked? Is your computer license ID number? It's sending some error notifications and warning messages to the Microsoft server, sir. Yeah, so what I don't understand, Selena, is how do you know that my pho this phone number that you've just called is connected to my address and my, my computer? Yes, it is connected. How do, you, how do you know that? Because you are a registered customer of Microsoft, sir. Because I'm a registered customer of Microsoft? Yes. Okay. All right, so tell me then, what what do I need to do to stop these hackers getting into my... You have to block the hackers from my computer, sir. For that, you have to be near the computer for a few minutes. Right, okay then. So I'm by my computer now. So what exactly can you see on your computer screen? Well, I'm just sending an email to somebody at the moment. Please close all the pages and come back to your normal home screen, where you can find all of your IT. Okay, just one moment. Complete. Yeah, okay. And where do you want me to go now, Selena? You have to look at the keyboard. Yes. On the keyboard, on the extreme left-hand side bottom corner, can you find CTRL key, the control key? Yes, I can, yes. Right next to that control, which key can you find? The alt key. Right next to ALT? Command, CMD key. Okay. Can you please pull up your Safari browser, sir? Yes, I've got uh, my browser open. Did you pull up your Safari browser? Yes, I have already. Okay. Can you find address panel? Yes. You have to type over there, www. Yes. A for Alpha. Yes. N for Nancy. Yes. Y for Yankee. Yes. E for Delta. Yes. E for Echo. Is it? Are you taking me to anydesk.com? Is it? Yes, sir. Right. Okay. So what? What? What are you going to get me? What are you going to get me to do? This is not. Rem this is the application which has been provided from Microsoft. Sir. With the help of this app, your your computer will be connected to the Microsoft server. Okay. Right. And then what happens? So we'll show you all the problems on your computer, and we'll help you out to block the hackers from your computer, sir. Right. Okay. So, and am I? Do I have to pay for this? You don't have to pay any amount because it's not a business or a sales call for you. It's not what? It's not a sales call for your computer. No, it's not a it's sales not call. A... No, but are you going to charge me for doing this? No. No. You're not going to charge me anything? No, sir. This is a free service completely? Yes. Right. So, Selena, so I'm a, just a tiny little bit worried because this is the first time we've spoken, correct? Yes, sir. Yeah. And um, I'm not aware of any hackers getting into my computer at the moment. Yes. So. I, you know, I'm a little bit reluctant for you to go and have a look in my computer. Do you understand why I'm saying that? Yes, sir. I can understand. You have to download. You have to verify all the reports on your computer screen. Okay. Mm -hmm. This provide you each and every reports on your computer screen, sir. You don't have to worry. Okay. Mm -hmm. So 
what exactly can you see on your computer screen? No, at the moment I'm at the remote desktop software website anydesk.com. Yes. Can you find the option called download? Yes, I can, but I'm I don't like downloading things on my computer. You're not downloading, sir. It's just a application. You have to connect to the server, okay? No, I understand that, so that you can then get into my computer, correct? That's your objective. No, sir, we are not getting into your computer. Well, who's going to... No. How are you going to remove the... Silencer is not being... Say again. Hello. Hello. Uh, sir, this call is a transfer to me. My name is Jason. How are you? Yeah, Jason, I'm great. Where are you? I'm also fine, sir. So now can you tell me what you can see on your screen? I'm on the website anydesk.com and your colleague is asking me to download the application on my computer. Exactly, sir. Till now you will not download, then how you can able to rectify the problem? Well, this is what I'm, uh, Jason, a little bit concerned about because you're telling me I have a problem and I'm not aware of any problem. Yes, you're not aware about the problem because you're not technical minded. Uh, how do you know that? Because you are the basic user of the computer. If you are a basic user, that's why you're speaking in this way. <laughs> yes. Well, <laughs> that's a really interesting assessment you're making. 